My name is Nikki Wedlova. I'm from Deep Kloof in Soweto and I'm a hair artist. When I started making my first headpieces, I was mainly inspired by my fashion background and my creative expression when it comes to hair. So I wanted to just combine the two and offer something different. My creative process um, varies, like it differs depending on what I'm working on. It can be inspired by an image that I see online. It can be inspired by a fashion or anything really. And then I will start by making the piece. I don't usually do sketches. I just start by making the piece and work with it as I go. And then, yeah, and then I have the final piece to present to the world. My current body of work is a headpiece inspired by the Fulani tribe hairstyle. Uh, Miriam Makeba also did uh, one of the hairstyles. I just wanted to pay tribute to her uh, because when I did it, it was on her birthday because mine is on the 3rd and hers is on the 4th of March. So I just wanted to pay tribute to her to evolve the hairstyle to the modern times and just to make it my own. The techniques that I use are braiding. I would braid the hair extension, followed by burning it so that I burn the ends, so that like, the ends don't come out. I usually use synthetic fiber. I also use wool. I can also uh, do wool balls with it, um, like my hair. The other technique that I use is weaving because I see hair extensions as a form of textile rather. So I just want to showcase people how versatile hair extensions are. So I use the plain weave technique. Um, I also use the basket weave technique. Um, you can see it in uh, fashion and also furnishings as well. And the other ones then is just using um, hair accessories just to accentuate like the look or the colors depending on what I'm working on. Um, something that no one knows about me, except for my family, I think. Uh, but yeah, uh, back in the day, I was a backup singer for a reggae artist. I was just going through my own, you know, um, expression times. I was just trying to prove to myself if I can sing. And then I went for auditions and they picked me. <laughs> so I was a backup singer, like we performed, um, at an event and that was the first and last time. <laughs>